Hi, and welcome to www.fabequilts.com. This is your site for all things concerning quilts, including free patterns and video tutorials. I'm Carolyn Wainscott, and in this segment, I'm going to show you how to print your photos with your inkjet printer on the fabric sheets that we prepared earlier. You can follow the link in the video information to that tutorial. This wall hanging was made with the photos that you'll see being printed. It's a housewarming gift for our granddaughter Angela, so let's go get those things done. To print the photo fabric, you will need your inkjet printer. Make sure you have lots of ink. You will need your computer with any photo editing software that you have. I use an old program that I'm very comfortable with. I'm going to choose the canvas size I want to use, which is an 8x10. I'm using a background color on the, each canvas in this blush rosy color because that is the color of the uh, cummerbund on the bride's gown. The photos I'm going to use I have put into a folder so that it would be easier for me to get to. I'm feathering the edges so that the photos will collage together. That's the method I use. You don't have to use that. Let's put another couple of photos in to add to the wedding center block. And these will be cut in a heart silhouette. Make that cute. I only put one photo fabric sheet at a time into the printer. That helps lessen any jams that might come up. And we have our wedding photo. Now just a couple of hints for making your quilt. Keep in mind that the photos are the focus, so frame them in some unbusy fabrics that coordinate but are not going to detract from them. I chose black to give a modern effect and to go with those photos. Uh, you'll notice that I chose as a background that kind of uh, mauvey pink um, on each photo, and that was to match the cummerbund on Angela's uh, gown. You can make any color background you want or just leave it plain white. The photo editing was just touched on since this is about quilting and not computer skills. And the photo editing will be featured in an upcoming video on my Mam Granny channel on YouTube. 
Thank you for being with us here at www.faithquilts.com. New ideas, hints, and tutorials are added daily, so check back often. You can also like Fave Quilts on Facebook and leave comments or ask questions and share your quilts with us. This is Carolyn Wainscott, and I'm so glad that you've joined us today.